National Chicken Wing Day. Our Mark Soliday is live from Erie's Chicken Wing Mecca this morning. Yeah, Otis 12 out in Mill Creek. Mark, are your hands dirty yet? Have you gotten to eat any chicken wings here at Six? Patience, Brisha, Brisha, patience. Yeah, we're gonna, we don't serve any wings before their time here. Yeah, move over Bobby Borgia and Keller's because I am where the magic happens this morning. We're inside the kitchen at Otis 12, Erie's Chicken Wing Mecca on this National Chicken Wing Day. And we've got uh, Joe and we've got Linda Fisher, the operations manager here, ready to cook us up some wings at this very early hour. Never too early for chicken wings, right? So Joe, let's set the, put those wings uh, into the fryer and Linda will bring you in here. Linda's uh, been uh, the operations manager manager here for a while and been in charge at Otis 12 basically since the place opened right 18 years ago no no <laughs> I've been here since uh, for eight years oh eight years yeah. I'm sorry but let's talk about they, the place has been here in 12th Street for 18 years talk a little bit about Erie's love affair with the chicken wing that plays out basically daily here at Otis 12 yes we have been in operations for 18 years here on West 12th Street for eight and um, the chicken wing love has not ceased to <laughs> amaze us on a daily basis um, even our employees, myself included, the love never fades. Yeah, you were telling me earlier that, yeah, you, of course you can have chicken wings every day when you're here working and you haven't gotten sick of them yet. And when you go out somewhere else, the wing is still your choice. Absolutely. Absolutely. Can't go wrong with a chicken wing. Um, I like to judge them as well, but I eat them probably four to five times a week still here, even after eight years. Let's talk quickly about this cooking process because, you know, folks can try to make the wings at home, but... You know, when you get here to Otis 12, it's a whole nother level of wing cooking. What makes them so special here? Um, our professionals, our, yeah. <laughs> our cooks, the people who have done it for a while, um, those who enjoy working here and putting the, the time and the effort and the work in. Let's not take a quick, that's sorry, what makes it let's take a quick walk, walk over here. They've got 150 plus flavors of wings that they serve up here at Otis 12. Here's kind of where that magic happens. Linda, explain uh, what you've got going here as far as the wing flavors are concerned. Um, yeah, so we have over 150 wing flavors and we do allow you to mix and match um, flavor sauces seasons to make your own flavors as well. That's kind of how we came up with a lot of our um, signature styles. So the wings would come over here, go into the steam pan and there's a person here, we call them a wing saucer, and they would then sauce the wings before they go to your table or season them. Um, a lot of our stuff is, as you can see out here, but some of it is kept cold in a cooler behind us. Um, yeah, so that's, this is where the magic happens. And I, earlier I had posed that question to Brissa and everybody at home. How many chicken wings does Otis 12 serve up on a typical day? Drum roll for the answer, Linda. We actually serve up around 2,000 chicken wings a day. So I know I get, somebody guessed around, what, 47,000? <laughs> We're a little <laughs> off from that mark, yeah, but about 2,000. So there you go, 2,000. We're, We're going to be serving up one batch uh, very early on this National Chicken Wing Day. Having some fun with the crew here at Otis 12. Brissa, for now, we'll kick it back to you.